Welcome everyone back to Twisted Gaming TV. Today we're going to check out my game room before and after when we, me and the wife, started building this. Okay, so what we're looking at now is the master plans of the build. Uh, you can see my house on the right and the game room, the two-story building on the left. Okay, so the bottom is the garage and the top is the game room. Here's a side view. So I pretty much designed this and then had a designer put my thoughts on paper. Uh, so it looks pretty cool. Um, it's a total of 2,300 square foot, well, 2,330 square foot, uh, 1,160 square foot on each level. So here's the garage part. And then the mud room is basically storage with the stairs going up to the game room. So you go in the garage, through the storage, up the stairs, and you enter the game room. Now we're checking out the game room right now. You can see the movie area, the bar on the left, the half bath. And then at the bottom is uh, the game room area where all the arcade machines are and all the displays and everything else pretty pretty sweet um you know the original uh, budget that we had for this was a hundred thousand dollars and then we got crazy and got a lot of high-end materials um so it ended up costing you know two hundred thousand dollars so it was double uh it went over a hundred thousand dollars over our budget so that was slap in the face. So it cost us more than we wanted. But um, yeah. And this is when they were laying the foundation. They were preparing all the foundation work. Um, and this is the day they started pouring the foundation. It was pretty cool to see all of this done. It was uh, very exciting. Uh, the wife and I was very excited. Now, you know, the by looking at this picture right now, you know, it looks small, but it's huge. I mean, it is huge. The garage is huge. The game room is huge. I mean, this is bigger than my house. My house is only 1,600 square foot, and this is 2,330 square foot total. So it's pretty, pretty wild. I wanted the game room on top because it's good, uh, good security. Um, you know, you have to go through three uh, stainless steel industrial doors to get in the game room. Um, and we have cameras up here. We have cameras outside. And it has an alarm system. So, I mean, as soon as you come upstairs through the door, you're on camera. Uh, it's, it's pretty wild. So, there they're pouring the foundation. This took about a day to pour the foundation. Uh, it was really fun to watch. I took a f few days off um, to um, watch this process because I was, I was too excited. You know, I kept calling my wife when I was at work. You know, how's it going? How's it going? Um, the whole process took about three months, um, you know, but it, it, it was definitely worth it definitely worth it a lot of good people that helped uh, build this uh, garage game room now at first we were gonna do a one story just have a game room on the bottom and then have a just not have a garage but I was like eh, we need a garage and this is when um, they started putting the walls up And this is a little fast forward when they had the second story built and they were starting to put the siding on the, uh, the game room. And once you see the side view right here, you can see how massive this is. It's really big, really big. In a few seconds, we're going to go inside it. So here's the bottom of the garage, it's the skeleton look. Water heater goes right over here. And there's the stairs that go up in the game room. So basically, if you're in the garage, you go through the stainless steel door right here. You uh, you make a right, and then 
you go up the the stairs and then it leads to the game room now one thing is it, it took three or four people to haul all my arcade machines upstairs because you know three or four hundred pounds on each one is you know is a lot of weight so this is upstairs so you're looking at the game room area here's the bar over on the right so we're gonna we're gonna go up a little bit and the arcades are right here on the right now uh, and then on the left is where my computer and the uh, the display cases are this right here is where the two flat screens was going for the retro consoles I wish I would have did CRTs, but I don't know. I was just trying to go all high tech on it. So that was, you know, oh well. So all the arcades are lined up right here now. And just to let people know that this is actually my game room. There's proof right there. So and in the next few days, you can see more progress in the garage, where they're starting to do the insulation and putting the boarding and up and stuff. Here's the storage room over here on the right that they're doing all the blow-in insulation. In the garage, we just did the roll-out insulation, but see right here, you can see all the, uh, the blow-in insulation. Now this room ain't AC, the garage is not AC, but they keep cold, man, even in hot, hot weather. Now upstairs is all blow-in insulation too, and it has AC and heat in the game room. But uh, in the garage and the storage, we don't have no AC or heat. But, I mean, it keeps, it keeps the heat and the cold out in the bottom. And then you see up here, they were starting to put all the walls in, all the sheetrock. Pretty awesome process. I mean, this was just, it, every day was exciting when they were working on it. Now, some days they didn't show up because you know how construction is. Some days they show up and don't do no work. Sometimes they don't. There's the attic up there. Now the attic has, we, we put flooring all in the attic so we could use all that space. So there's, you know, basically another 1,100 something square feet of storage uh, in the attic. And you can actually walk up in the attic too. That's how big it is. There's the bathroom. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. And this is wall on the right where this is where the... Um, 120 inch projection screen is so now I'm now I'm in the bathroom oh no this ain't this is walking up the stairs again this is some more progress on another day when they started doing all the tape and bedding on the walls but you're looking at the movie theater in right now and the bar over on the left and here's the game room area pretty awesome There's the big window. I always love looking out this window. It's pretty, pretty dope. Okay, and then here's a, a fast forward another day where they're really, really moving along now. Now you can see the storage area is closed in now. Now we're going back into the game room type area. And you can see that they're starting to do all the... Um, texturing and making it all pretty now but yeah this this top when they're doing all this work and stuff boy it's a mess man now all the light fixtures and stuff are not in it yet that's coming up pretty soon but yeah it looks it looks great looks really good here's the movie area again Here's the bathroom over here. We were gonna put a shower up there, but my wife didn't want me to live up there, so, live up here, so um, she said no, no uh, shower. It's, it's pretty funny, but you know it. It's it looks way bigger in person. Um, 
than what you're seeing on video. Okay, now here's another fast forward day. Here's the garage area part. They got the lighting in here. Um, this is when they, they painted all the walls and everything. So, um, looks really, really good. We got the doors on. There's a lot of gaming stuff and lights and stuff that we're going to go in the game room. So, this is the process where, you know, I'm getting all the stuff ready to put in the game room. Now, it, getting all the stuff where it is today in the game room, it, man, it took a lot of time uh, to figure out. I had it in my head where I wanted to put all the stuff and how I wanted it to design or whatever, you know. Okay, so right now we're in the storage area part and behind the garage. Uh, stainless steel double doors there. And see, now we're going to go up into the game room. And now you can see all the finished areas, the bars getting finished, the bathroom's done. We got all the 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 sick wood floors. The wood floors, I love the wood floors, man. It looks awesome. Got all the tile work done. Then the lights were going in. And then and this is the game room area when I started. The Guitar Hero and the Killer Instincts, they were the first ones in the room. Uh, and then that's when I'm setting up my displays and stuff. Uh, it took a lot of work. There's my computer desk up there. I mean, over to the right where I stream. So it looks really, really nice. And this is the after part. This is what it looks like now. It's pretty, pretty sick, man. It's It was a long time coming, but, um, you know, and a, and a lot of money. Like I said, you know, we were on a budget for a hundred grand to build this thing. I don't know what the hell we were thinking about, but ended up being $200,000 to build this stupid thing. So, you know, a lot of money, a lot of money. But it's well worth it, though. It's very exciting. Here's the movie area part. Pretty dope. Bathroom area. Pretty dope. Looks really good. But I'm, you know, adding to it here and there. But yeah, here's the movie area again. Here's the game room. I mean, it's it's magnificent. It looks very beautiful. Anyways, thank you for watching Twisted Gaming TV. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Always comment back. Till next video. See you later.